Did he steal the... Did he steal the thing? Son of a gun! He stole the chest. Welcome, welcome everybody to another Sea of Thieves Rush. We are rushing out of the door of the tavern to get to the ship. Rules are as always, boots in the sand, get to another island, get something to hand in and get it back to an outpost. Now, uh, getting on the ship, we generally don't look at the clouds, we just get on it and go. So there's the potential for some uh, PvE Kraken <laughs> encounters right out of the gate. And... Uh, you know, we, we try not to, uh, to second guess what's going on. But I want to go for some different islands today. Because I always go to islands that are fairly near. And we have a little extra time on the clock. As you can see, I've upped my resolution a bit. I'm still having some green screen issues. Look, <laughs> just, I'm looking a bit washed out. But I'm going to go with it anyway. And uh, see if we can get stuff done. So I'm going to head to this big island here. And then I'm going to spend a reasonable amount of time there if I... Uh, get there in one piece. I want to say Devil's Ridge, but I'm I'm not 100% sure on the profile of that island from this distance. I'm sure somebody's going to put me straight. The game will when I get there anyway. Uh, nobody around. Oh, we have a skull cloud up. Oh, hang on. We have something on the map. Let's see how far that is. Oh, that isn't far at all. We are changing tact. We are going for a Reaper's Chest rush. So, northeast. Let's do this. Usually, boots in the sand with uh, Sea of Thieves rush, but with the Reaper's Chest rush, I'm, I'm changing the rules because the, uh, the time that they're there boots in the sand and then getting back just it, it, it's not gonna work um, we need to get them and rush back and then there's a potential for the PvP because other people are gonna want these things they are well sought after well what I could do is if I change the rules up a little bit so that I still have to do boots in the sand but I'm allowed to pick it up first then that means you know I can just hop over to this island that's here and uh, and get my boots in the sand, get something else to hand in, and then that opens me up for a little bit more PvP. Cause I'm, you know, I'm not scared of other pirates. I, I don't like dying. I don't like losing stuff, and I'd rather not have encounters. But that's the whole point of this, this little uh, session I have in the morning is to get me ready for the day, get my adrenaline up, and uh, you know, what better than a bit of PvP? But I don't see anybody in the near vicinity so I think this is going to be a clean extraction and uh, and return so I'm close enough to an outpost to make this definitely doable but it definitely gets you a little bit ooh you know they could come out from behind any island without you knowing um, and uh, surprise you so that's paradise spring oh look what's that Oh, that's just a skelly. Okay. Whew. Could come through the storm. You never know. There could be somebody just lurking, waiting, rushing the way I am to get this. But I want this. I see the the birds. Now, do I uh, try and get some hunter's stuff as well from the barrels? Yeah, it'd be foolish not to, because I'm right there, right? I'm not carrying anything. The ship's not on the surface, it's a little way down, I mean it's going to have, unlikely to have any air pockets. And it's close enough to this island that I might start getting cannon too, so. And the storm's coming. Maybe I get close, I anchor down, I put it in a hard turn. And then that way I'm... I'm kind of turned where I need to be. And I can hear cannons flying in now. So get this Reapers, get back on the ship, fix it, and get the heck out of there. Actually, probably get the heck out of there first. Now, it could be anywhere. It could be on the lower deck. 
There's a gem. Yeah, it would be nice to get the gem, but I don't have time. Okay, this time it's on the lower deck. Some people have said they've seen two on a shipwreck before. I hate those little glitchy sticks that you get. Two on a shipwreck? I don't know. I've, I'm yet to see it, yet to believe it. I think it's like a shrouded ghost, ghost thing. It's a myth. I think Rare approaches different streamers and they say, Here, take this. This is some footage that we've faked and make a nice story. They might even create Twitter accounts and, and do it. But create a story that you encountered. We'll pay you X amount of money to keep the myth alive. So that was a hit on top deck. So my mast might be damaged, so this could be a, a broken mast right here. Let's get out of here. I'm still going to do boots in the sand, so this is going to be... Repair the ship. Get rid of the water. Still getting shot at. No other holes. It was just a single hole. That's pretty handy. I'm not even going to stop the ship for boots in the sand here. <laughs> I'm just going to let the ship carry on. And uh, you watch. Somebody will spawn in at the outpost. Oh, hang on. Who's that over there? Oh, yeah. I got somebody coming to get the Reapers. So let's get my sails in. Uh, sails set correctly. So I'm getting the the wind I need. No, not that way, you dum dum. They're gonna try and cut me off. Okay. So boots in the sand for the rush. These little rushes, they're kind of like Race of Legends. Now I understand Race of Legends a little bit better. Oh, can I sort lunch to my ship again? Oh, crud. That would have been so cool. So now I have to get a mermaid. And they're bearing down on me. This is, this is intense. Oh. Who's to say they're attacking me right now? I can't hear any attacking. I'm hoping to make the outpost. But I'm thinking it's not going to be doable. <sighs> okay, where are they? Oh, there they are! Hello! They're on the ship. Which ladder are they on? He's on a ladder, I heard him. I just don't see him. Did he steal the... Did he steal the thing? Son of a gun! He stole the chest. Let's be thinking I've still got it. They've already got one on board. Wow! That was brazen. So he's in the water. So what do I do? I'm going to cannon over. That was a mistake on my part. They're going to be going. I'm not going to make it. Shot. 
They're off. Oh! <laughs> That's your Sea of Thieves rush for you. You get a little bit of uh, excitement. Wow. Now my ship's going to be toast somewhere. Oh, it's still sailing. Oh, little stinkers. So I got 23 minutes on the rush. I can go back to do the standard rush, but man, that was sucked. Let's pick an island. They're off. I'm I'm leaving them. There's no point giving chase now. Let's go Snake Island. It's always full of riches. It's bound to be something I can find. Oh, that's disappointing. And there's another brig. Is that's not the same brig, right? Let's see. Oh yeah, it could be. No, the other brig I'm seeing is heading across me. They could be chasing the other one. I heard water, like the water on the ladder. I didn't see him come up. He must have been so quick. Grab the chest because I left it right there. I didn't even try and hide it. Uh, well, there's a lesson to be learned there. At least put it below deck. Because then at least somebody's got to run down and get it. Just don't leave it on the f top deck there in the open. So I've learned my lesson, I hope. If you see me do it in a future rush where I just leave things out in the open, um, like the Reaper's chest, <laughs> tell me. Shout at me on the chat and say, no, don't do that. Oh, that was so frustrating. Oh, what's this? Oh, I've done boots in the sand, so. Blue gem, other floaties. Yeah, I'll. I'll cash in on you guys. Was that a flappy chest? I've never seen a flappy chest in... No, it's not. Oh, lovely. Create a fine ore. I'm still going to carry on to Snake Island because i got 21 minutes, but... I will definitely... They should put a tiny little ladder at the back just to climb in the back area. Like, having multiple boarding ladders could be a problem, though. Maybe one you can throw off the back if you're playing. So if you come here, it's like a rope ladder, and you just toss it off the back of the ship. And uh, it makes for easy access. That would be kind of cool. Maybe a rope ladder needs to be like bought from the ship, right? To be used. Or, I don't know, some something fun like that. Where would I put the other stuff? I left it up on the top deck. What a donkey. I said, don't do that. And I did it. So that's two good finds right there. I could do a hunter's rush and hand the gems in. But I'm going to have a look in the barrels. Because I want more hunter's stuff if I'm going to do a hunter's rush. Probably should take some planks. At least get to max capacity on the planks. Ah, uh, cannibals, sure. I think it was just four barrels. Do I want to take a floating bottle? Could be a problem. I think I'll leave that one alone. The thing is, we're doing a rush this time in the morning, and my whole green screen situation is... I, I start the rush at around about eight. And it's quite dark outside, so I had the light on and everything. And then as I'm sitting here, the, everything's getting a little brighter outside. The, the sky's getting a little clearer. And so I get all washed out because of the... Let's see, I get all ghosted. Anyway, call me the Shrouded Ghost. SG Daddy, the Shrouded Ghost, the friendliest ghost you'll know. So my son's telling me yesterday, he's like, I don't like our channel anymore. And I was like, well, you don't do anything on it. Um, you know, he's very, he wants to have a channel, but he doesn't want to do the work for it. So, so I was in a down funk yesterday, and then I'm like, no, no, 
I like doing it. I'm doing it for me at the moment, and eventually he'll come around if he wants to be part of it. You know, as soon as it gets up into the thousand followers, I'm sure he's going to be like, oh, wow, well, we got tons of followers, and like be really proud and want to tell everybody. And So I'm like, no, I'm just going to keep doing it. I enjoy it. Do it for me. I love bringing the rush to you every morning. It's something I do before work and I love. And You know, if my work situation changes, who knows, it might, uh, I might have to change everything up, but right now this is the way it is. Oh, Blue Mermaid over there, look at that. So I can make this a hunter's, get, uh, get the mermaid gems, get them into the, the sea post right over there. There's a green one. I'd need a barrel or something to help me out with that one. I can do the blue one on my own. Easy peasy. Hey kitty! We have... Who do we have here? We have Trooper! Trooper the cats come to join us on the stream. Hey Trooper! Yeah, so... Dread Doug and his little kittens. I know how he feels. These guys are kittens. Not that long ago. But, uh, yeah, Dread Doug was the, um, the pirate on the stream, the rare stream yesterday, if you didn't see it. And, uh, yeah, he did pretty good. I didn't see the whole stream. I got kind of waylaid, um, just other things I had to do. And I got a skelly ship in front. I'm going to go over to the beach over here. Hmm. I had a cannonball in the cannon. I don't even remember loading the cannon. So, um, oh. There's the Where's Waldo snake. There's a rowboat. Hopefully I can put something in it. That's like a double sword thrust sound. And, uh, and it sounded like I was... I missed it just from the huff. So maybe there's a sound glitch there. I never really know if their sounds are intentional in games sometimes or not, so I I don't know if to, I, I should report it as a glitch. Let's cook that coconut. I don't see anything here that I want. I'm going to row around the island. Come on, boat. Need an outboard. Some magical outboard. <coughs> There's something on the beach, I think. Looks like a crate of cannibals. Oh, wood crate 45. Wood crates are actually pretty high value for what they are. Um, so that could be just worth selling. Um, from a standpoint of gold, pretty good. Skelly shot me. There's something else on that beach. Yeah, nothing there. I might look on the island. I can hear the mermaid, but that's the green one. Probably should eat something. Don't see any explodey barrels or anything worth my time. Time is precious when it comes to Sea of Thieves Rush. You have uh, limited time and spending time, 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 time. How many times can I say time? I even said how many times time. Sorry, I just got into a bit of a Joe Neat loop there. Alrighty, we are out of here. I'm going to turn said boat right around. Wood crate. Perfect. I'm going to hand that in too, if I can. 
right behind me is the sea post so let's do sea post and then outpost 40 minutes on the clock we should be able to do that and uh, get out of here and get my work day underway and I hope your day's uh, got something exciting it's always good to have something in your day to look forward to so uh, even if it's like I'm gonna have a beer at the end of work like just that beer is something that you can look forward to and you can be like yeah I'm gonna work hard and the day's gonna go quick and that beer is gonna be sitting there ready for me or you know I'm gonna kiss my wife when I get through the door and give her a big hug and that can be like something you promise yourself you're gonna do and something that she'll really appreciate and it's something you can look forward to as well depending on your wife but <laughs> Hopefully, uh, you can look forward to it. Um, so, yeah, make sure your day you have something to look forward to. Absolutely. Especially if you've got tough times and things going on. Those little those little things that just kind of help you get uh, get to the end of the day or get to through the day. If you don't have any anything, just just put something in your head. You know, I'm gonna watch that movie that I've been meaning to watch. I'm gonna spend 15 minutes in the shower and just uh, just kind of chill and relax and wake up a bit. You know, something. Wow, that's uh, that's pretty good. I'm happy with that. Okay, so what am I handing in here? I'm handing in the two mermaid gems. Can I make the jump? Not really. I can grab the ladder. Who is it? It's Merrick! Didn't... Oh, wow! That's a good way to board the ship. So you jump, and instead of grabbing the ladder, you grab the harpoon. Because I wouldn't have made that jump unless I tried to grab in midair. So interesting. Yeah, that's uh, definitely something to clip and share with uh, with people because that's a a little trick right there that somebody might not know and could really appreciate. Okay, so we've handed in this and a time saver for me too because that little swim and that ladder climb that's seconds on your on your timer. Now I gotta turn quick. Uh not quick enough. Oh, I'm making a big pig's ear dog's breakfast. Pig's ear is a dog's breakfast, or it could be. Anyway, I digress. Uh where am I going? Oh there, oh come with me to the rolling sea. Where the weather is calm and still. And we'll have some fun as we Go a sailing. Oh, that was terrible. The wee hee hee isn't right. I, uh, I definitely messed up that one. Throw it in my rowboat. Yeah, that was cool. I've never done that before. So you grab the harpoon as part of the jump. And uh, and hang on to it. it. It could be a good way to board a ship from the front if you're attacking an enemy, and you need to make a um, make a quick uh, thing. Is you got to remember to let go quickly. So if you do it and you grab hold of the harpoon, you're like, ah, I'm stuck. You know, like, grab and let go. But uh, it could be something worth practicing a few times, like just more up to a dock and practice that jump routine and hang on and let go and until you got it down pat and then you can use it when you need it. There's always something in this game that comes along that kind of surprises you and you're like, oh wow, something else I figured out that I didn't know I could do. There, so I got two things to hand in. And the wood crate, it comes to like a thousand five hundred sometimes if you get a full wood crate. So it's one of those things that you don't think is worth much because it's just wood, but to gather up 50 planks of wood on your own, time consuming. So 
It's almost like they're paying you for your time, your effort. Oh, headwind. Dagnab it. Maybe I'll come around the back of the outpost. I'm kind of kicking myself about these Reapers, guys. I'm wondering if they're anywhere near and possibly going to come into the outpost in the next nine minutes. Doesn't look like it. Looks like they may have even handed in and and left. I'm guessing you'll get people that jump servers and then if they don't see any in, on, in the sky within five minutes, they'll jump to another server and uh, and try and find these things quicker bit of a pain but I'm sure people do it if you got a fast computer and the loading times are really quick then why not you know oh, I look so washed out look at me I look sick it's like a sci-fi movie where there's some someone's getting influenced by an external source one of those like Doctor Who things where they they would like green screen you but they would wash you out and like oh I'm dying you know oh the alien is sucking my life from me <sighs> so I'm gonna go to the merchant dock and try not to graze my ship on the bottom here Hey, look at that! I did exactly what I said I wasn't going to do. You are so on the ball this morning, Mr. Turner. Yeah. And look at that, your dozy fart. What do you think? <laughs> it's fixed the hole in the ship. What the heck? I got three planks left. Seven minutes on the clock. Let's get the minerals in because they're worth a pretty penny. You could just sit here and see if any barrels spawn that uh, that I can go harvest any hand in stuff. Just run around the outpost with my telescope. Sword lunge out and grab them and hand them in. Yeah, minerals. Yeah, look at that. 1,800. I wonder if the planks will be worth more. It's possible. It's possible. Do I get a yes or a no? What do you think? Before I hand it in, anybody? Anybody going to give me a yes or a no? Nobody? Okay. Shaking my planks. Shaking my planks. Shake my planks. Okay, Merchy Merch. What are you going to give me for it? Come on, be generous. Oh, don't talk to me. Oh, you're rude. Ah, I failed. Didn't even get a thousand. So, what's going on? Do I sail my ship away? I, I think I might drop the rowboat because somebody coming in would really appreciate a nice rowboat, right? It's in good condition, good work in order. Doesn't have a harpoon, so it, it's not like the deluxe model, but it's going to be useful to somebody. I might even use it to row around and look for barrels before I leave. Okay, up sails. I'm going to send my sloop off into the blue. Decoy. Someone can go attack it before it sinks. Or I might send it into the island. I've got four minutes. Maybe I'll miss the island here. Put it in a full. There we go. Let's get my rowboat and see if I can gather something up in four minutes around the island. A barrel. Make use of my time. I'd like to do a rowboat uh, mini game with somebody like robot racing or. Um, the robot tether challenge get 
get a bunch of robots on one island with uh, harpoons and tethers. Uh, maybe one without in the lead and just see if we can tether like five rowboats and one person row. How many rowboats can you drag along at once? Oh look, there's two things in the air. I'm doubting neither is close. I'll be able to tell if I... Yeah, no birds above them from here, so they're quite a ways away. Just booting it around the... I say booting it, this thing's as slow as a molasses. I see a ship over there. That's Snake Island. Oh, there's another one. I got three minutes on the clock. Let's see what that Snake Island ship does. Are they coming over here? Are they going to go for... It's a brig. It's possibly the one that stole my stuff. I'm not going to be able to row over there in three minutes, so... And they're probably going to go after the chests, I would think. There goes my sloop. Bye, sloopy. You're going to come back in, aren't you? I got you in a turn. You're going to crash. Yeah, here comes sloop. Yep, here it comes. It's going to crash into the island. I wonder if I can sword lunge out to it and save it. I'm not going to save it even if I get on it. It's going to crash. No, nope. Bye bye. <laughs> Sounded like it was sinking. It's going to hit the island. Boom. Oh, it went up the dock quite nice. I wonder if I could drag it up on the island with the harpoons. I've got one minute to try. Yeah, it's going down. Can't save my ship, it's gonna go down. Well, that's me. I think I'm done for the day. For a Sea of Thieves, anyway. <laughs> I wish I was done for the day. Pause the clock. And I'm gonna finish out with the usual, if I can get my head straight. With the usual. Tra la la boomsy, tra la la boomsy, tra la la boomsy, tra la la boomsy. You all have a good day, okay? Take care, everybody.